When scientists explore the deep ocean, they don't always come back with clean answers. Down there, the water is silent, the pressure is crushing, and the darkness is absolute. It's the most unexplored place on Earth, and every new mission brings back something stranger than the last. Some discoveries are fascinating, others are so disturbing that even the experienced researchers were shaken to the core. These are 10 terrifying real discoveries in the deep ocean that left scientists genuinely unsettled. In 2012, after a violent storm tore through the Gulf of Mexico, divers made a discovery that felt like stepping into a time capsule. Off the coast of Alabama, 60 feet underwater, they found an ancient cypress forest that had been buried and sealed off for more than 50,000 years. What terrified scientists wasn't just how well preserved the trees were, the wood still oozed sap, bark peeled back like it had only fallen a few months ago. That kind of preservation isn't supposed to happen underwater for that long. When researchers began studying the site, they found that the forest was crawling with strange, never-before-seen species of marine life. The trees had created their own isolated ecosystem, thriving in total darkness. Some of the worms and bacteria found in the samples were unlike anything recorded before. What scares scientists most is the potential for ancient, dormant microbes to be awakened. If these organisms were trapped for tens of thousands of years, what else might be sleeping? sleeping deep in other submerged environments. In 2014, a group of oceanographers studying Arctic currents stumbled upon something no one could explain. Near the Laptev Sea, they detected a massive, stable, underwater vortex spinning with incredible force beneath the ice. Normally, whirlpools like this break apart after a few days or hours. This one has been there for years. It's more than 50 miles wide and reaches over a thousand feet deep. When equipment was lowered inside, the instruments went haywire. Compasses spun wildly, pressure sensors gave readings that didn't make sense. Some scientists believe it's caused by warm water escaping from deep layers of the Arctic Ocean. Others believe there's something even stranger happening, like the beginnings of a new kind of self-sustaining oceanic phenomenon. The scariest part? The whirlpool could be a preview of a larger, more dangerous event as polar regions warm up. If these grow unstable, they could affect global currents and climates in ways that we don't fully understand. Imagine descending to the seafloor and seeing a lake sitting inside the ocean. That's exactly what scientists found in the Gulf of Mexico in 2015. Known as brine pools, these underwater lakes are made of extremely salty water that doesn't mix with the rest of the ocean. When remotely operated vehicles touched the surface, the pool behaved like a thick, syrupy barrier. Any fish or crab that accidentally fell in would die instantly. The pool is so toxic, it literally preserves corpses on its surface. What terrified researchers wasn't just how lethal these pools are. When they sampled the water, they found microbial life that had adapted to survive inside this toxic brine. Some of these microbes metabolize chemicals in ways that we've never even seen before. These organisms could provide clues to alien life on other planets, but they also hint at how life could survive in some of the most dangerous conditions on Earth. In 1911, explorers in Antarctica noticed a strange red stain spreading across the white ice near Taylor Glacier. It looked like blood seeping out of the glacier itself, and when scientists finally sent equipment down decades later, what they found was unsettling. The blood was actually highly iron-rich, salty water emerging from a sub-glacial lake trapped beneath the ice for nearly two million years. But what disturbed scientists most was what lived inside that water. Despite total darkness, crushing pressure, and no oxygen, the lake is home to a thriving ecosystem of microorganisms. These microbes have been evolving in isolation since before humans existed. They survived by metabolizing sulfur and iron instead of sunlight. Scientists realized that this isn't just a freak of nature. It proves that life can thrive in places once thought impossible. And if it can happen here, under a glacier, it can happen deep beneath the ocean floor, where we've barely even looked at all. In 2015, oceanographers using sonar mapping in the South Atlantic came across something so strange they thought it was a glitch. A perfectly circular black void, roughly 30 kilometers wide, was swallowing water and trapping everything around it. At first, they thought it was a current or 
already, but this thing behaved differently. It rotated steadily without dispersing, almost like a massive black hole in the ocean. Floating debris and plankton near it got pulled in and disappeared into its spinning center. This phenomenon, known as a coherent eddy, was eventually confirmed to trap water and objects for months without mixing with the surrounding sea. Scientists fear that these eddies could transport pollutants or even radioactive waste across oceans silently without anyone even noticing. No one knows exactly what happens to material caught in the center, but what they do know is that whatever enters stays hidden for months and maybe even years. In 2016, a submersible exploring off the coast of California recorded a creature that no one expected to find there. It was a ghost shark, a deep sea relative of sharks and rays. These creatures are usually found in the southern hemisphere, but this one was more than 2,000 meters down, far outside its known range. Its pale, translucent body, rabbit-like face, and wing-like fins made it look like something out of a science fiction. But what unsettled researchers even more was its anatomy. It had sensory pores that detect tiny electrical signals, allowing it to hunt in pitch black conditions with terrifying precision. Scientists still don't know how this ghost shark ended up in the Pacific. It may suggest there are entire undiscovered populations of deep sea predators roaming the ocean floor in total darkness. In 2017, during a dive in the Caribbean, researchers encountered what looked like an underwater mirror. When their submersible got Got closer, they realized it was a layer of extremely dense water lying beneath the sea floor. This lake flipped the laws of physics on their head. The denser layer behaved like a ceiling. Fish approaching it turned away. When the submersible dipped into it, it was pushed back up as if it had hit a trampoline. Scientists called it a haloclean, a natural barrier created by extreme salinity and temperature differences. But what shocked them most was what was trapped beneath. ROV cameras captured strange, worm-like creatures clustered along the barrier, surviving in total isolation. It was an ecosystem completely sealed off from the rest of the ocean. No one knows how long these environments have been locked away or what else might be evolving beneath them. In 2020, a team exploring the Pacific seafloor stumbled on a bizarre microbial colony feeding on something unusual, iron and manganese nodules. These nodules take millions of years to form, but the microbes weren't just living on them. They were breaking them down and consuming the metals directly. This behavior shocked scientists. Metal-eating microbes can accelerate the decay of ships, submarines, and undersea cables. But more concerning, these organisms were unlike any species previously identified. Their presence raised disturbing questions. How much of the sea floor is controlled by unknown biological activity? And could these microbes spread, altering entire ecosystems before we can even understand them. In 2019, researchers mapping the sea floor off the coast between Africa and Madagascar noticed something alarming. Instruments were picking up strange seismic activity that didn't match any known fault lines. When they sent sonar equipment down, they discovered a brand new underwater volcano rising from the sea floor. Over just six months, it grew to 800 meters tall, releasing massive plumes of superheated water and gas. What terrified scientists was the speed. Most volcanoes take centuries to form and this one appeared seemingly overnight. The eruption caused tremors felt on land, and satellite images showed the seafloor bulging upwards. It's now considered one of the largest and fastest submarine eruptions ever recorded, and it raised a chilling question. How many other hidden volcanoes are growing in silence beneath the ocean? Deep in the Pacific, more than 4,000 meters down, scientists discovered a strange phenomenon they still can't fully explain. It's called the shadow zone, a massive stretch of water where nothing seems to move. No currents, no circulation, no mixing. When instruments were lowered into the zone, they detected old water trapped from thousands of years, completely cut off from the rest of the ocean. It's like a giant pocket of ancient water frozen in time. What makes this so disturbing is what could be inside. Some researchers believe the shadow zone could hold microbial life forms from Earth's distant past. Others worry it could trap carbon, chemicals, or even unknown organisms for centuries. It's like a vault at the bottom of the sea waiting to be opened. All right, guys, that has been our list for today. Thanks so much for checking it out. I've been your host today, Olivia Kozlowski, and I will see you again soon. Goodbye.